The TAVR procedure takes about, uh, it, it's, a, it's a full procedure to replace the heart valve. So really it starts from the workup. So an evaluation of a patient to first determine whether or not they're candidates for the procedure. At this point in time, the people that are candidates for the procedure are if you have a moderate, high, or extremely high risk for an open heart surgery. And this is an alternative to open heart surgery. So once you've determined that you are a candidate for the TAVR procedure, then several uh, workup points need to be done. In open heart surgery, they're able to take a look at the valve and measure the valve size so that they could appropriately size the, the uh, valve that they're going to put in. However, with the TAVR procedure, since we're doing this all from the groin and with x-rays, we're not able to size it as well. So we do a three-dimensional scan, CT scan, ahead of time to take a look at it. The workup is done usually in a couple of days. And uh, once we have all the information, then we're able to do the actual procedure. The procedure is a quick procedure uh, in which the patient gets brought to the operating room and the implantation of the valve itself takes about 30 to 45 minutes. The remainder of the time is uh, time spent getting ready for the procedure, the sedation or anesthesia process, and the sterile technique, which uh, total time in the room is probably an hour and a half to two hours.